Oh man, this is cool. I can't get over how this looks. It looks so good. Dude, we're doing it. What in the heck is happening right now? How is this even a thing? You want to chase me? I'm a pigeon. Here, let's go. Eh. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. No, I'm going to stop myself here. All right. No, 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 no. All right, let's get moving. YouTube, Moto Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Beam and G Drive. And yes, folks, we're back once again, and today we are back with a major update. So, folks, this is big. We have new vehicles, we have a new map, we have a new graphics update, and we have traffic that actually obeys streetlights. So, you're looking at the new vehicle here. This is called the Widgeon? I think I'm saying it right. This is like the ugliest slash best thing I think I've ever seen. It actually drives really good and I absolutely love it. And we're going to do police chases with it at some point. And you're seeing the Pigeon, which it has seen a complete remaster, which it's actually fantastic now. I love it. I love the way it looks. It's so crispy and clean looking. But. I think it could look better. So right now you're seeing the graphics pretty much the way I always have them set. It's actually kind of sunset right now, so you probably notice it looks a little darker than my normal videos, but they've added a graphics upgrade. So if you go to the new ultra mode, it's going to look a little bit different. So we're going to tick everything on and we're going to show you the true difference here. So let's do it. Holy man, check out the graphics upgrade. This is actually really cool. So the Ultra is in experimental right now, but I mean, look at the graphics. It almost looks in parts like photo real. Like check out the cliffs here, all the, uh, the new effects. It just looks extra crispy. And I'm pretty sure if I ever try to run like one of those massive police chases, uh, it's gonna blow up my computer. <laughs> I actually don't even know if my uh, recording software is going to be able to handle this. Uh, I might have to make a couple changes, but this game is absolutely gorgeous. Like a lot of people see those new pretty next gen consoles and they don't realize like how truly powerful games still are on the PC and how good they can truly look. So yeah, this is just one of the new things that we are going to be checking out here today. Uh, let's go ahead and get into the new car, why don't we? And we're going to go for a little drive here. Oh, it's so crispy looking. So yeah, if you do see some graphical glitches or maybe some stuttering or something, I'm still experimenting with the ultra mode, but uh, I'm hoping to uh, have all the kinks figured out here relatively soon. Plus, like I said, it's probably going to get updated a little bit too. But yeah, look at that. That's glorious. Also, let's look inside this new car. This thing looks incredible. Look at that dash. What the heck is this even supposed to be? Oh, let's stop it. I want to show you guys the other variations real quick. So, yeah, it's down here. You got the widgeon. Also, uh, let's go ahead and go to the pigeon, too. You can see, I don't know if any of these variations are new. I always have so many mods installed, so I can never tell, like, if I've got, like, the default setups all there or if it's some of the modded ones. But these are the default ones now. And then if we go over to uh, the widgeon here, check this out. You've got the darter. It's got, like, a little wing on it. And there's actually a four-wheeled version of it. So you have the pawn skipper, the sprint and this thing called the mantis which the mantis uh oh geez okay it's rolling a little bit it kind of looks like the old lotus uh paint schemes on the old formula one cars it looks incredible and i'm hoping that it's really fast plus it's nice and open too so uh, you can kind of see out everything so if you guys are excited for the new update be sure to hit that thumbs up button let me know what you guys want to see down in the comment section below out of future beam and g episodes and yeah let's go get in trouble Like I said, if I spawn in a bunch of AI, I'm pretty sure it's gonna start lagging really quick, but I mean, I never thought that Beam and G could possibly look like this, and I'm so excited for the future here. Also, this thing is so speedy. The speedy boy, oh no, it's gonna spin out. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, <laughs> oh geez. All right, let's take off again. So I do have some other Beam and G episodes already recorded. So here in the future, you're probably gonna see a couple in the old like graphics engine but uh just do keep in mind that uh i do 
pre-record quite a bit and uh yeah this update came out this morning i was like oh no i gotta make an episode on this like asap that way i could show you guys uh for those who are not familiar with the update or don't know that it's actually updated now because i was actually uh, really surprised this morning all right let's park ourselves up here i like this version of the car uh we're gonna check out some of the other stuff here in a second including the grid map version 2 and we're going to go into West Coast to see the traffic and how they actually interact with the uh, stoplights. All right, so I've spawned in traffic. Welcome to uh, West Coast USA. Also, we got a new version of this. It's the, uh, the darter. I am noticing a little bit of stuttering with traffic, so it's definitely a thing. Uh, I don't know how many cars I can get away with running. Like, right now, it's fairly smooth, but when you take off or move, like, oh, geez. Okay, well, that was pleasant. What the heck? This thing kind of floats whenever it crashes that's weird uh but yeah i noticed uh i do get stuttering sometimes when i'm kind of going into new areas so i'm hoping that gets addressed a little bit but it might also be my hardware i, I do have a new computer on the way uh it does have a 3090 in it so i'm actually really excited once i get that to see how smooth it runs also this thing has uh nos why would you stick nos in this this is the uh the three world version too so it's probably going to want to flip over all right let's enable the nos all right, let's go and see what kind of speed we got here. Oh, no, this is too much. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is bad. Oh, <laughs> hey, oh, jeez, we got hit again. The roll cage held up fairly well, at least for the driver. The passenger, like, what's the point of the cage? The passenger is dead. <laughs> oh, it still drives. I don't know how it still drives, but that's a thing. So, uh, another thing that they've updated. Let's go look at a uh, light. So this will be cool for like, I guess you could say like police role plays or when you're playing uh, the police car against the AI, you can, I guess, watch them run some traffic lights. Here, we're gonna park up on this real quick since we have a little tiny car. Uh, let's put the parking brake on, let's get out. So let's observe here. So right now the light, okay, there's not a, actually that was a red. Did he just run it? Okay, they're going through, it's green. So now it's red. So let's see, is anybody coming this way? Hey, Mr. Van, are you gonna stop? Uh, let's see what he does real quick. So he's gonna pull up here and Thought they were supposed to abide by the rules here <laughs> So I'm stupid uh, that's not a surprise to anybody but West Coast USA traffic lights are still in the works East Coast are active right now uh, so we might need to go over there real quick, but at least you got to see what West Coast looks like with the new graphics. Okay, Komodo is going to stop being a ding dong. By the way, we're going to play with one of the uh, remastered pigeons here. So this is East Coast USA. So let's head into town real quick. Why does it seem like there's a lot more vegetation now? I could be just going crazy. Maybe I'm just going crazy here, but it looks a lot busier. All right, here, let's go this way. Oh my God, the game's so gorgeous now. I, I don't think I can handle it. Okay. Uh, where is town? Uh, I think it's right over there. Watch out, ding-dongs. So, yeah, it says it's going to improve the uh, police interaction, so I'm assuming maybe people will still run like red lights. I could be wrong about that. I know you get speeders, but we need to do another police episode with the radar gun mod, uh, like the police interior. I think Neil did an episode like that not too long ago, and with the new graphics update because I feel like that would be amazing looking. All right, here we go into town. So we should have some traffic lights somewhere in here. I know it's a lot of stop signs. Watch out, I'm going to pass you. Here's a traffic light here. So let's watch. Right now it's green. Okay, let's get on this side. All right. And, oh, you can see actually over there to the right. Uh, they're stopping at that red there. Okay, so this one's about to turn red. Hold on, let's get out real quick. Okay, so this one's red. So, this dingling over here should be able to drive through, but anybody coming this way should actually stop. Are you going to hit me? Watch out, buddy. I like when I go to actually watch the traffic lights work. Nobody actually comes from this direction. Okay, well, certainly this light's going to turn, right? Uh, okay, this one's red now. Uh, you got to be kidding me. Okay, this one's green. See, he's driving through. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on, show me that I'm not crazy here. Okay. This one's green. Here, let's go to this one. Uh, okay, this one's green. Okay, so he's going to drive through. Is this one red or is this one turned green yet? Oh, that car just spawned right in front of me. Okay, this one's still red. So, see? He's stopping. He stopped at the red light and then watch. It's going to turn green and there he goes. So, yes, they're actually implementing traffic working with the lights, which is 
actually fantastic. So we can just get over here and hop back into our car and we can take back off. Of course, we're not gonna abide by the traffic laws. So now I kind of wonder if we run a, uh, a light in front of a cop, do they actually go after us? I know they normally go for speeding or if you hit somebody or hit them, but I wonder if that's a thing. That might be kind of cool. Hold on, let's spawn in police real quick. All right, I believe this is an unmarked unit in front of us. So, all right, I think he's coming up to a red light. So if I do this, huh? Huh? Did you, did you like that? Uh, I don't think they interact with us doing this right now. Come on. Look, I'm gonna come right back through. I'm running the red. Okay, well, that doesn't seem to be a thing at the moment, but still. Uh, all right, let's take off here. What about this cop, huh? You want to chase me? I'm a pigeon. Here, let's go. Eh. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. No, I'm going to stop myself here. All right. No, 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 no. All right, let's get moving. What the heck? Why is this bus pushing this car? Okay, we can just hop up on the sidewalk. We can fit through here. Oh, okay. Never mind. I just got stopped. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh. Uh, okay, we are totally stuck. We need to go backwards. Oh, I've wedged myself on a set of steps. That's embarrassing. Well, that was the world's shortest chase. Oh, let's crash head on to a vehicle with the remaster. Oh, hi. <laughs> nice to meet you, Mr. Cop. Oh, it looks so excellent. Uh, I got an infraction for speeding and police collision. Okay. Was that always the thing where it showed you your infractions? All right, so we're ready for the next big addition, and this is grid map two. Uh, what? This is insane. So yeah, in the description on the uh, update, it says they basically took grid map and split it into several different sections. I didn't expect it to be this big. Is that a water skipping area? That looks cool. Oh, it's rivers. Oh, I think they're actually moving at different speeds. So yeah, you have that. You have some really crazy ramps, tunnels, uh, a bunch of stuff to play with, like a pyramid. Uh, it looks like there's a lot of banked curves, almost like racetracks in here. Dude, this is insane looking. There is so much to this now. Uh, tons of little obstacles, little terrain type areas. Oh man, that's cool. Look at that. They so have like little rocky areas, like sands, water, grass. That is sweet. So we can go up here. It looks like we have like a, this looks like a new little obstacle course or like a little crawler course. That's cool looking. Uh, you got little uh, off-road sections here. Man, there's so much to do here. Wait, what is this thing? Uh, oh, there's a bowl down here and then you have this. Oh, is this a wall riding thing? I think it is. We definitely have to do that. Uh, you got more obstacles. This is insane. There's a lot to the grid map now. I like this. So you think if we took the fastest little widgeon thing, this would work? Also, what is the pond skipper? I, I guess it's just the off-road version of it. You have a sprint version of it. Uh, there's another sprint too. Uh, this one has fancy wheels and a special uh, livery. But here, let's go with the manis real quick. Okay, and let's speed over to this. I'm curious. Can we let this thing wall ride? If not, we're gonna have to grab like another fast vehicle, but I just wanna see if this can happen because if it can, this is gonna be amazing. How do we get into this thing? Do I need to drop the car in here or is there an opening? Uh... Oh, there it is, okay. Here, we'll speed into here. Let's go and grab a couple gears and let's go up into the Dome of Doom. There we go. And let's start to pick up speed. It's gonna take a second for this to work. Oh, okay. I don't know if we have the grip. I don't know. Here we go. Uh, kind of go up. Okay, we're up on it. Okay. Oh, jeez. Uh, I don't think this vehicle's fast enough to do this. Maybe the Formula One car would work really well. Okay, hold on. Let's just ease up. Oh, here we go. Dude, we're doing it. What in the heck is happening right now? How is this even a thing? How high up are we? Oh, jeez. Oh, this is incredible. Okay, hold on. Let's get up to the top. Try to stay in this lane here. How are we doing this? Uh, I'm gonna make myself sick. Dude, this is so cool looking. All right, are we ready to fly out? Let's go. Ooh -wee! Oh, this is gonna hurt. And... Oh! <laughs> Beautiful. All right, I wanna do that with a fast car. Okay, hopping up into the, uh, the wall of death here. All right, here we go. 
All right, and okay, wait for some grip. All right, here we go. Oh, this is beautiful. It's a little heavier car, so I think it's gonna take more speed. Hold on, let's go second gear. There we go. Yeah, I can't really go much faster than this. You know, I need the assistance of like nitrous. Like, I feel like that would be really good. You no, know, I thought this would work a little bit better with this car. Uh oh. Oh, we're losing speed. Okay, this is fine. Oh, that is cool looking. All right, and let's just go. We pop out, and can we land on all four? Nope. <laughs> that was uh, that wasn't smooth at all. But that was kind of nice. Do we have just any like massive ramps? Like I'm sure there is massive ramps. I'm just not seeing all of them. Uh, there's just so much to look at. Oh, there's a couple over here. Uh, do we have any with like just ridiculous lead ups? Also, this is kind of interesting, too. This is a terrain test here. Uh, we were looking at this section, but this is actually like a hilly version of it, which is nice. You know what? This looks like a nice high banked like speed track here. And also, it's basically a wall ride. Here, let's try this over here. All right, let's go. All right, get some speed. Nice. Okay. Oh, beautiful. All right, so we need to ease up on the banking. Okay, fifth gear. And here we go. Oh, yeah. This is cool. Uh, that building's a little close to that little tower. Oh, okay. I think we can get more speed here. All right, stay within the lines. And then we're going to go to the top of the banking here. This is like an extreme NASCAR track. Dude, that is cool. Okay. I like this. I like this a whole lot. This, uh, this whole area is just amazing. All right, let's just fly off the banking here. Oh, come on, land, land it, land it. Oh. I don't know why the crashes actually look a little bit smoother. I don't know what's happening here. I love it, and I'm super excited to get the new computer. That way we can run this hopefully flawlessly. Okay, we're heading over to this area here. I'm gonna see what this is all about. Oh, this is, oh, it's a nice little loop-de-loop -loop area. And wait, what the heck, this falls off. Oh, it's like a half pipe, hold on. Can we actually build up momentum in here? All right. It's going to be bolide half pipes. On. Try to... Oh, it won't turn. It won't turn around. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, okay. Yep. I think we need something a little bit more grippy and has a little bit better acceleration. All right. Here we go. All right. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Let's just build up momentum. So we're going to come back down here. Okay. And then we're going to turn again. We gotta just build that momentum up with the car. I gotta get it to turn though. Come on, okay. Let's try to turn it again. Oh no, I don't know how to do a uh, half pipe properly with a car. Like I feel like there's a way to actually do this and it would work. Uh, of course Komodo doesn't know what he's doing half the time. I'm actually kind of shocked I have an audience and people watch my videos, but all right, let's go up in, uh, let's go up in here. I know we can make this. All right, up. Uh, get first gear. Okay, come down. I think I broke something. No? Okay, it seems good. Okay, oh, and let's try it. And, uh-oh. Oh, we made it. There it goes. Oh, we barely made it there. Also, I think we just crushed the... There's like a diffuser or something on the back of it. Actually, it fell off. <laughs> I think it's gone. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. I love this. All right, let's start to, start to go to the left a little bit. Yeah, buddy. Oh, this is going to hurt. Uh, oh, 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 we're coming down this and ooh, that was brutal. Oh man, there's just so much to check out. I strongly suggest you guys uh, check out this update. Uh, it came out today. Uh, we'll have more videos on it. There's a couple more things I want to cover, a couple more things I want to do. But there's just a lot to take in right now. But thank you guys for all the love and support on the series. You guys are amazing. We'll see you guys next time.